In today's video, we will be talking about five of the best Roblox obby games. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe to this channel. Are you ready? Let's go! Number 5. Obby King This game is quite underrated, with only a few hundred people playing currently, and only has a 60% upgrading the game. It is pretty much as it sounds. You compete against others to prove that you are in fact the Obby King. There are over 70 maps, countless different levels kind of ranging in difficulty, and overall it's seemingly a pretty good game. I would say this game is a mix between relaxing and including rage, because while overall it seems pretty calming, as soon as you fail, you brought back the beginning in which you can get more and more aggravated. So I guess it depends on the person playing it. Upon entry, you step into a circle with other people to set up the game. This is understandable and it makes sense that you have to match people up for a round, but then instead of taking you right into the game, it takes you to yet another obby where you have to wait even longer. This can even be frustrating, but it's just a small con in comparison to the pros. Number 4. Speedrun 4 if you've never played it before, Speedrun is an obstacle game of course, but with the addition of Speed hence the name. There are many different levels, each with different themes and music, and the overall goal is to complete each level as fast as you can and you race against your friends or play by yourself. And I personally find this game incredibly relaxing. But I know it can get quite ragely, especially when you can finish a level. One of those levels that many enjoyed 100% is the ice cream level for some reason. Players just have the hardest time completing it. The main thing I personally wish for speedrun is that there are more of it. We've been on for speedrun for quite some time, with minimal updates and I'm absolutely craving more levels for the game, that's why I decided to put it at number 4. On this list, but with all that being said, it's still an extremely fun game and definitely worth checking out if you've never played it before. Number 3. Mega Easy Obby If you're someone who hates rage including obbies, and you really just want something super simple and easy to play while you are watching a movie, or a show or YouTube video, you know I see you. And this is the obby for you. It's super colorful and aesthetically pleasing. There are over 650 stages in total, so you know you'll be playing for quite some time. And if none of that convinces you, maybe the fact that tens of thousands of people are playing it right now, and it has 78 thumbs up rating, which if you know Roblox, that's an absolute miracle. So I guess I've said quite a bit of good now, but what's the bad you may be asking? Well, the only critique I personally have is how busy the screen is in-game, Roblox games lose a lot of professionality to me when they have a ton of buttons on the screen. That's just scream click me, and this by no means is one of the worst games for this, but there are still 1 to 14 buttons on screen, and that's a bit too much for me personally. Number 2. IQ Obby At first glance, you may be deterred from playing this hobby because of its low rating and number of players, but I promise you guys, it is so much better than people have made it out to be. If you want an obby that will actually challenge your brain, then this is 100% for you. These developers have put a new spin on obbies and have made one into more of a puzzle where each level is far from what it seems. And what I like even more is that in an obby game, you'll have the option to skip levels if you pay in Robux, which is also an option in this game. However, the more levels that you complete, the more IQ points that you earn, and you can use those IQ points to skip the levels that you can trade for life. If you're younger, this may not be the game for you, and maybe that's one critique for this game is that it's not entirely good for every Roblox player out there. But even specifically in the description, they say it's recommended for older players, so you can't hate on him too much for that unless you're one of the 20,000 people who dislike likely because you couldn't figure out one of the levels. Number 1. Tower of Hell 
Tower of Hell is exactly how its name makes it out to be. A Tower of Hell. It's an obby of course, but instead of it being just straight across, like most obbies, it's actually going up in a giant tower, and it has made multiple levels distinguished by different colors. There is a time limit and your main goal is to get either as far as you can or complete the entire tower, which many players really struggle to do. It is a super fun game, but it's also really hard sometimes and will definitely make you rage at one point or another. There aren't many critiques I have for this game, as it's pretty how much it's intended to be very competitive and difficult, but if I could add anything, it would be a 100% checkpoint. It would at least receive players of some of this stress while trying to complete the level, so that would increase the player's enjoyment of the levels. This brings me to the end of our video, I hope you enjoyed it, hit like if you did, and don't forget to subscribe to our channel so that you don't miss out on any of our videos in the future. Also watch the two videos that are on your screen because I am sure that you'll love them. With that, I'll see you in the next video.